Sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. Yeah, yeah, you It's okay. Been. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin. I'm working on that. Well, I'll figure out that it's Martin. I mean, we already know it's Martin. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll... Let's see here. Let's go... Oh, we got a new suit on. That's cool. I got the Iron Spider suit in the lock yet. Uh. Now this suit's cool. I'm, I'm, I'm Work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. The mayor was in danger of her and killed Lee. I like that animation stuff. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Thanks, May. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. That Peter. Man, that Peter Parker. I should check out Lee's office. Wow, Peter. You said you're gonna help her out, but you're there just there to scoop around. I know Pete, I made like that. Glad to see you're okay. Hmm. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't feel safe in here. And nobody is paying attention? And I just did that, huh. nobody? Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the... This. High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can. Nobody notices that I just jumped into his office either. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. journal. A key. I wonder where the lock is. Such a nice couple. Such a nice couple for such an evil man. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Well, maybe the only he has figured out the balance. Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. Yeah, I think it's like in the drawer or something. Ah. Hmm. Some oh. kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. I see. Do you? I don't. Let me 
said this is right. right yes I have no idea how I just did that <laughs> giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Pretty impressive, isn't it? Can feel my power growing. Feeding off my anger. Why is that such a weird picture of him in this one? Maybe. This is all about Norman Osborne. His whole career. Lee well, must have been obsessed with him. What a weirdo. I mean, of course, I end up hating Norman Osborne because he's a green goblin, but that's besides the point. Oh, this is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Um, yeah. Phew. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. It's a burn room. Why are you destroying one more? Oh, that's not good. The police had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Ooh, cooler. Now, how do I get out of here? Oh, easy. The door. Hello, Peter. Oh, Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. He well, knows. I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, wait, wait! Ah! Ah! What the? 
He possessed him. He is actually a pretty cool suit. Just the animation on it is really cool. Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah. See ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? Should get taken. Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. I wonder if this means I have a job again. Yes, I can stop by. Just for a minute. All units, there's an active pursuit of a box truck believed to have a bomb. Incident is ongoing oh, in the West well, that's Village. Right. Cops can handle that. I gotta go check out what Dr. Otto Octane this wants. Missed another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet. Always gotta fix that hair. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get... Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Cool. I'm in. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know... Until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay. Sorry. I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- Mad science. Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test.
So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone uh, calls us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Oh no. Not these missions. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. Actual voltage six. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? Okay. I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. <laughs> Missed call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. What's that? Such a cool scene. Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but... Yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. You think it'd be hard to screw this one up? 